Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of 12 Days of Christmas this year. I'm going to start off with a kind of an odd sized uh, card. It's cut at 10 by uh, 4, 10 by 4, yes, because it's the envelope that I found is kind of an odd shape, so um, I'm making a card to fit it specifically. This is a card that I saw uh, while doing my rounds on Pinterest, um, getting geared up for this series, and I could not resist the temptation to recreate something uh, very similar. This particular uh, card is going to be using the really just non-traditional colors that I've been going with um, recently. I don't know why, it just seems like a good challenge and a lot of fun to do, so that's why you'll see a lot of the uh, you may have noticed in some of the previous videos that these colors are not necessarily something that you would consider Christmas under normal circumstances. So I'm going to try and talk and work at the same time. I don't usually like to do that because I feel like I don't have anything interesting to say. <laughs> Maybe you would rather listen to music than talk, listen to me talk. Okay. So I've just cut two strips of this tan colored paper and it's um, desert sand paper from Close to My Heart and they're cut at four by uh, one and a half inches. So you need two of those. I hate that my foam dauber thingy lets out all this stuff. Time to get a new foam square on this thing. Um. And you want to separate them, leave them about a half an inch, um, a quarter of an inch apart. Then I've cut another piece that's at um, three, and f three and four quarters, no, excuse me, three and three quarters uh, by um, three and three and three quarters by four, I believe. Yeah, I think that's what it is. And I'm going to just uh, distress the edges of it really carefully. going to be using a couple of stamp sets. Uh, first of all will be the uh, this one called Saint Nick and I'm going to use the sentiment from that stamp set. I can find a block that'll fit it. Actually, you know what? I originally planned to do a bigger card so maybe this isn't going to work. Bummer. Okay, give me... Oh, I know what we'll do. Hold on one second. Okay, change of plans. <laughs> because my card ended up being smaller than I thought it was going to be. I'm going to use this Holiday or Cheer stamp set, and I'm using this um, sentiment here. Uh, let's see, okay. So I'm going to try and... I'm going to put the sentiment first. I think that's what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm going to use hmm, thinking that I will use bring up that desert sand color up here. I'm going to take the smaller, this uh, bigger snowflake, excuse me, off of this stamp set, which is the Holiday Trinkets. I think I used this one in my last 
episode, or I know I've used it in this episode, one of these episodes recently. And then I have this one, which I know I use at the beginning, I think, um, and the other non-traditional Christmas card, and I'm going to use this kind of medium-shaped, medium-sized one. Okay. The ink I'm going to be using is the cocoa, the darker um, brown. And I'm kind of just going to put a piece of scratch paper beneath it. And this uh, cocoa almost looks black, but it's it's not. And there's that. And then I'll use the smaller stamp. And you know what? I think I even want this smaller than that one. Like that, but I'm going to pop this up, whole thing up on foam squares. that. It's a fun foam squares and then I'm going to, I've already uh, tied a bow with this, with some of the um, color ready seam binding. I'm not going to color, it's a really barely off of the color, just barely, barely. And I'm okay with that. <laughs> I don't mind that so much so I'm going to go ahead and use glue dots to adhere my bow. like so far and of course I cannot do a card lately without putting some kind of sparkle on it. So give me a second I'm gonna try and find there we go. There's the pearl ones. I have some brown ones. the white one to be okay. Alrighty. I don't want it to be too blatant. I'm just going to do a big
sorry, I ripped off the adhesive off of that one, off of those two. Lifting it up with my scissors, I gotta be more careful. There's the finished card. Hope you guys like it. Thanks for watching.